welcome to my studio. Um, I have my Nomad book. I filmed a video about this book journal um, earlier today and I am going to start working in it. I'm so excited. I have images. I have words. I am just going to start putting stuff in it. Um, I have no idea what to expect but I am just going to enjoy the process of adding things into this book and we will see what happens and I hope that you enjoy it as much as I do. I'm so excited to get started in this book. Let's get going. Okay, I have my book. I've got scissors. I've got paper cutters. I will probably pretty much just use mono adhesive to adhere everything down. I don't really want to use um, my glue stick for the big images because I don't want to um, warp the pages at all. And since it, everything's pretty much just going to be in here, um, mono adhesive will work great. And let's see, I have some words here on a plate that I had just been kind of collecting the past few days. I've got this box that is just totally full of all sorts of things, words and phrases, um, some quotes and old things like that. My goodness, I've got all the images that I showed earlier that I just kind of pulled out as I was cleaning and organizing my space. I have another tub here on my cart that has images on it, um, in it. Um, just because um, I'm wanting to start working in one of these little guys and each day just trying to add an image and a word just kind of something in the morning to start that daily practice just a daily routine of starting out my day doing something creative and so this is where a lot of the images to put in that will come from so I have that and then I have another tub full of images from who knows where. Um, I don't know why they're in that tub whenever I moved. Um, within all everything that's happened the past year and with me moving and whatnot, I don't know why I had put those in that tub. I don't know if they were just in there to sort out later. But I do have another plastic bin full of just random images. Everything else that I have, if for some reason I'm looking for something specific, some sort of a theme or a certain type of image, if I know that I want an outdoor image or um, like a clock or um, a flower or something like that, I will turn to my drawer units, um, my um, iris uh, six drawer units that I have stacked up over um, on the side there. They have all of my images organized by category and then I do have um, my books on my bookshelf that where I also um, get images uh, for my collage work. So those are the areas that I'm going to be pulling stuff from but right now pretty much I think I'm going to focus on what I have here. Um, I think I am just going to not work front to back. I'm going to flip around through the book and add images where they want to go. I'm not going to try to force something to go um, on the next page if I don't feel like it wants to be there. So um, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. and. We'll see what happens, and like I said, I know I said this several times, but I am so excited um, to start working on this. Um, it's really, for sure, just sparked up my, um, gosh, everything. It sparked up just my desire and, and yearning and wanting to start being creative again. So um, I hope you just enjoy, sit back and watch, and um, enjoy my process.